Dear brothers and sisters, we are now entering the Holy Week. I hope this video will help all of us to prepare ourselves for the coming Passover feast. Jesus entered into Jerusalem. When Jesus openly entered into the Holy City, it also means that Jesus wanting to enter into our life, our Holy City. In the Palm Sunday liturgy, there are two parts. The first part will be the welcoming of Jesus into the city. And the second part, we will look into the passion of Christ. The church wants us to see how contradicted we are. The same people who welcome Jesus are the same people who crucify him. Because they realize Jesus was not what they expected. Jerusalem is a big city, just like today, Kuala Lumpur, our capital. Jerusalem is full of business going on there, a busy city, trading, political, religious, everything. Poor people are around, rich people also there. Everybody have their life going on and very complicated city. And this city, Jesus want to enter. And this city is just like our life, a very complicated inner life. Our life is full of busyness, a lot of areas just like Jerusalem. We hope that Jesus can help us to solve our problem. Sometimes we hope that Jesus will help us financially, help us in our study, help us in our family matter, help us to have a change to serve our one thing and our needs. My brothers and sisters, do we really understand why Jesus entered Jerusalem, entered into our life? Jerusalem is a big city. It has a lot of fortresses, a lot of walls, a lot of defenses. When Jesus enters into Jerusalem, he has to pass through all these fortresses, all these walls, the doors. In our lives, sometimes we build a lot of fortresses, defenses, and this will prevent God enter into our life. Our false self, our defenses, let us open our doors and open our life for him to enter into our Jerusalem. Jesus wants to do something great in this week. Let him be the Lord of our life. In Matthew Gospel chapter 21, verse 10 to 13, Jesus entered into Jerusalem. He straight away to the temple and he saw people trading there, making the place dirty, mess up the place and he chased everybody out. Jesus cleansed the temple and also Jesus want to cleanse our temple. As St. Paul said, we all are the temple of the Holy Spirit. We are the temple of the Lord and Jesus entered into Jerusalem. He wants to enter into our temple and clean our temple, our sins, our pride, greedy, all kinds of things. There are three parts in the temple, the courtyard, the sanctuary, and the holies of holy. Our life is just like the temple. As St. Thomas Aquinas said, we all human have three faculties, spirit, soul, and body. The body is just like the courtyard in the temple. The soul is the sanctuary, and the spirit, which is the holies of holy. The high priest once a year only enter into the holies of holies. And Jesus want to enter into this holies of holy. He want to heal us. He want to cleanse us if we allow him. When he enter into our holies of holy, he will use his own blood. He is the high priest and he is also the lamb who sacrificed for the sins of all. Brothers and sisters, in this Passover feast, Jesus in his passion, the sacrificial lamb will shed his blood into our Ark of the Covenant. The covenant is no longer written on the stone, but in our heart. So brothers and sisters, let us truly prepare ourselves by opening ourselves totally for the Lord to come into our life, our temple, and into our whole being. May God bless you all. Have a blessed Holy Week and Paschal Feast. Amen.